Hi, I'm Mike Davenport, Louisville Chevy dude here at Bachman Chevrolet in Louisville, Kentucky. I have some special cars here, and I'll tell you what, they're great looking. This one here is special to a couple people, Dom and Pat down in Crossville, Tennessee. They asked me to show you the car so that way you could enjoy their car with them. I truly hope you enjoy it, and if there's anything that I can do for you after the purchase, Dom and Pat, please don't hesitate to let me know. All right, so this is a 2LT model. It's got the red calipers, the chrome wheels, jet black interior. It's got the sport mode exhaust on it, which is a fantastic exhaust system to have on this car. Love the new front end of these cars. They look fantastic. The exhaust outlets in the car have the interior which is another fantastic feature of this car. We have a heads up display. That's the smallest steering wheel in Corvette history. We have all the driver information center inside the steering wheel, as well as all the uh, radio technology, the heated seats, the air conditioned seats, power outlets. Inside here, you've got your USB ports, power outlet in there as well. Your mirror, steering wheel controls here as well. Let me show you this uh, car with the top up. So here it is with the top up. It's a power automatic top. One button push up, one put button push down. And the really cool thing about this is it's also able to come down from the key fob. So I don't have to be inside the vehicle in order to bring this down. I love this feature of the car for a nice hot day. From your key fob, you just bring it right down. All right, on the inside, we have the driver information center, which is a fantastic thing. Five driver modes, I'm currently in the touring. If I go this way, I go to sport, and it'll change the way that looks. And I also have a track mode, and it changes the way it looks when I go to track mode as well. Also, when you go to track mode, in sport mode, it changes the exhaust when you have the performance exhaust. Now, if it's, if it's possible, if I can get this to see on here, you have heads up display as well. So with a heads up display, when I change it back to touring mode, it changes the way it looks. And if I go to track mode, it changes the way it looks as well. Now here I go back to sport mode. Other features on the inside of the vehicle are the MyLink navigation radio. It's all touch screen. The really cool thing I like about this is you got storage in the back. And then you also have dual climate control, air conditioned seats, heated seats. Over here you have air conditioned seats and heated seats for the passenger. However, this is usually not used because the passenger has their own controls right there. Temperature controls, heated and air conditioned seats. Now everything on the car is a touch button to pop the car open and closed. And same with the driver's side. The driver's is right here, open and closed. And if you notice on the door right here, we have power uh, memory seats, excuse me, memory seats. And then the power locks are right here that are all touch as well. Over on the left side of the steering wheel, you have your power convertible top, which is there. You have your power mirrors, which is on the far left over here. And then the heads up display I showed you is right there. Power tilt, telescopic and steering wheel. Paddle shifting right here. And then all your driver information center goes through here. So on your driver information center, to go back to that, you can see that I have uh, a warning there saying that my door is open. I can hit one button on my driver information center steering wheel controls and I can handle that. Now if I change that on my arrows on my steering wheel, that goes through that as well. If I come over here, I've got a little bit more information on the car that I can go through as well.
Okay, Mike. <laughs> Thank you. See ya.